Hi babies, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole, AKA The Fragrance Thought. And today we're gonna be reviewing three different things. We're gonna be reviewing the KKW Chris Candle, the Trio Purse Sprays, and the new crystals that have just released. So the first thing we're going to review is the KKW Chris Candle. It is the match to the KKW Chris fragrance, which I absolutely love. It's a more mature, uh, warm scent, which I would definitely use now during the winter, like the holiday season. It's a great scent. And um, the candle smells exactly like it, which I love that about Kim. She makes the candle smell exactly like the perfume. The KKW um, Crystal Gardenia candle was chef's kiss. It was exactly like the Crystal Gardenia perfume. Loved it. Wish I would have bought more and others sold out. And you're probably going to be paying like 100 bucks for them if you find them on eBay or something. Sadly, this is also sold out. It's not uncommon for her candles to sell out. Like I said, Crystal Gardenia candles sold out pretty quickly. This is sold out now. I'm sure you can find it on eBay or Mersari or, or those other resale apps or resale apps. Um, but as of now, not on the website, sold out. And I don't think she'll be restocking. She has not restocked the Crystal Gardenia one either. So don't really, I wouldn't count on it. However, if you do get your hands on it, I think if you love this fragrance, you, you'd love this candle for sure. Um, if you don't love this fragrance, then obviously you don't wanna buy this one. Um, I love it, I have it, I bought three of them. Um, they were, I wanna say 25 bucks each. I know it is a little steep for a candle, but her candles smell incredibly. They burn incredibly and um, it makes the whole house smell. And it's only a one wick, which is very, very impressive. You can compare it to, I guess, a three wick Bath & Body Works white, bar white barn candles. Um, I believe it has the same power and it's only a one wick, which is, like I said, very impressive. Worth it, obviously, you know, I'm gonna say that because I love this scent. If I didn't like the scent, then maybe I wouldn't like the candle, but I love this scent. I love the KKW Crisp Perfume. And so I um, bought this candle and I love it. If you're not into the warm, more mature, adult-like smells, just steer away, stay away from this. If you do, then this is a great perfume for you. I think she still has this in stock, the perfume. I, like I said, the candle's not. This is a great gift for any kind of mother-like figure in your life. This is what this candle was um, made and made for and represented at the time, which was, I think it came out around Mother's Day. It was... Kim and obviously her mom, Chris, and they made this together and it has like two women on the, on the front. Super beautiful. Um, and like I said, I love it, love it, love it. I say that all the time about all of her fragrances, but pretty solid. And moving on. Next, I'm going to go over the Trio Purse Spray, which you guessed it, I love it. Because first of all, it was 45 bucks for three 10 millimeter bottle, millimeter bottles, milliliter. <laughs> Am I saying millimeter? Millimeter. <laughs> what are you? An idiot sandwich. <laughs> milliliter bottles. I think it's great. It's 30 millimeters in 30 milliliters in total for 45 bucks. Um, I love the packaging, but what I mostly love is that they're sprays. I, for whatever reason, hate roller balls. I despise roller balls. I don't know what it is. I just don't like having a little like blobs of perfume anywhere and make like it makes me feel sticky and stuff don't like it so if you're gonna have a travel perfume anyone out there who makes perfumes please just make travel ones sprays it just makes the most sense these three are three of her classics and really good ones all solid scents three of my favorites crystal gardenia uh emerald diamond and body body you already know that is a money scent that is a sexy ass scent emerald diamond fire if you watch my Diamonds 2 collection review video, you can click right here um, to watch that. You would know that I freaking love it. Crystal Gardenia, you already know, a classic, a staple. And um, I love that she put all three of these into one set. I think they're perfect, perfect, perfect for gifts. Absolutely perfect. You can split them up and put them in like little um, gift baggies or you can just give it as a whole. I was very happy and very pleased when she dropped this. I think it was very smart of her to do so right before the holidays. Um, perfect stock, stocking stuffers, like I said, just perfect gift all around. What I love is that if you are a perfume lover, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, 
the little nozzle, the little spray. <sighs> um, it is awesome. Whatever it is that makes the little spring thing, whatever, it is perfect. It has a nice smooth, whatever you want to call it. Um, it doesn't like spit at you. You don't have that issue. It's very smooth. It sounds crazy, but if you're into perfume, you know what I mean. And that's really all there is to say about that. If you want to um, hear my review or watch my review on these scents individually, you can click up here um, for the entire collection review, or you can um, watch the Diamonds 2 review video to uh, where I review the Emerald Diamond. Okay, the best for last, the new crystals. So if you watch my previous video, the entire KKW collection, I review Crystal Gardenia, Crystal Oud, Crystal Citrus, Crystal Pear and Peony, and Crystal Violet Musk. Those, that whole collect, Crystal just, it's just great. My favorite out of all of those, the five of them would be Crystal Citrus. And um, it's been sold out for a really long time. And when she announced that she was restocking all the originals, I almost freaking fainted. Not for me, because I still have so much left over, but for so many other people who really wanted to try them. I felt so bad because there was no way of getting them except for paying resale price, um, but they restocked. So that's amazing news for all my subscribers and those who have been interested in smelling Crystal Citrus specifically. She's kept Crystal Gardenia in stock, but a lot of people wanted to smell that crystal citrus and it is now available. So take advantage before it sells, it sells out again. So I don't know when she'll be restocking. But with the restock came three new crystals. So we have crystal vanilla, crystal rose, and crystal peach. Now, I'm just gonna go in order of what I said. So crystal vanilla, let me read the notes for you. Crystal vanilla, top, orange essence, sparkling sugared fruits, winter wild berries, mid, Vanilla chiffon, winter honeysuckle, poinciana flower, dry, cocoa butter, vanilla, vanilla absolute, and benzoin resin. I don't know what any, honestly, like what this scent right here is vanilla at its finest. It's like they put a little bit of water and they put a little bit of vanilla extract and this is what it freaking smells like. If you, listen to me, if you do not like vanilla, do not buy this, okay? A lot of people hate on vanilla scents. When she did nude lips, oh my God, it was like the end of the world because they said it smelled like warm vanilla sugar from Bath and Body Works. Honestly, I just, it doesn't matter where you get vanilla from. Once vanilla is like the main scent, vanilla is vanilla. That's in my, that's my personal opinion. So if you do not like vanilla, do not get crystal vanilla. It smells exactly like vanilla. To me, delicious. There's a time and place for it, yes. Like, I like to wear any of my vanilla scents at night, maybe after a bath, in the winter. Um, it's certainly not a daily, everywhere I go type of scent. But if you love vanilla, this is your freaking go-to right here. Moving on, we have Crystal Rose. Now, this is delicious if you are into florals. I feel like I need to emphasize these a little more because I get these comments on my videos that are like, smells like a grandma, smells like this, smells like that. Okay to each their own, obviously. That's why <laughs> I review them based on how they make me feel. I freaking live and die by Crystal Gardenia, and the more I come across people, the more I realize a lot of people hate it because it is a little more of a mature scent. It's a floral scent, it's a very floral scent. So, warning, Crystal Rose is entirely floral. It smells exactly like roses. It smells amazing. I love floral scents, so it is certainly it's very, I mean, it is kind of like old people scent, not gonna lie, <laughs> but I love it. It's comforting. It's kind of like nostalgic, like, like you're at your, your grandma's vanity and you're putting makeup on and you're spraying her perfume. This is, that's the vibe I'm getting from this. This is something I would wear again at night, not something I'm trying to wear out when I'm feeling sexy and stuff. This is more like a comforting, like I said, nostalgic smell. I love it. I don't know. I, I really do like it. Top, bitter orange orper, orper or per italian lemon orper what is orper bay or by whoo i'm but butchering these today by rose orper oh my god mid rose concentrate orper geranium essence orper rose hip okay am i even saying orper right glowing amber tonka bean rock rose i don't know what any of those things are except for rose i didn't even say just rose straight up 
It smells like roses. It smells like straight up roses. I think it smells great. Would I wear this all the time? No, but it still smells great. Moving on. Also, it's pink. All right, last one. If you guys watch me and my videos, and if you follow me on Instagram, and you know me, you are ready. No, peach scented things, fruity things, is my jam. Okay, this is crystal peach. Bye. The best one, in my opinion, because it's peach. You guys know I was living and dying, and I still live and die by Kimoji peach. Oh my God, I love it so much. This, I'm gonna spray it. Jesus God, I love it. It does not smell like Kimoji peach. It honestly smells like, like Moscato or something to me. There's this passion fruit wine that Cooper's Hawk sells. It's so delicious. If you're into dessert wines or sweet wines, I am a lightweight. I don't actually really drink at all unless it's wine and unless it's like Moscato or something sweet like that. So if you're into that, you would definitely like that wine, but I'm going off on a tangent. This smells like that to me, like a sweet dessert wine. Like, oh my God, I freaking love it. In my opinion, it's the best out of the three. It's the most flirtatious one out of the three. It's a lot more sexy. It's fruity, like I said. Anything fruity I love, which gives me like that flirty vibe. Like I want to be flirty. I want to be flirtatious. Um, it's a perfect spring summer scent. But then again, I don't always base what I'm wearing on the season because also I live in Florida. Let me read you the notes. Crystal peach scent notes. Top, Italian bergamot, sparkling peach water, blue chamomile essence, mid, rose absolute, winter jasmine, lotus flower, dry, citrine musk, creamy sandalwood, and vanilla fluff. I only really smell peach there are some other mm, maybe sandalwood but for the most part i think it's peachy again nowhere near as intense intense as kamoji peach kamoji peach is like peach rings like super sweet candy like this is not that i think this is a great fruity scent for someone who's looking for something a little more on the less kitty like scent if that makes sense Kamoji peach is very kitty. It's very flirtatious. It's very youthful. And I feel like this is like the mature version of it. The best one. Okay, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm done. I love it. The three new scents, awesome. I love vanilla. I think it's a great scent. If you're into vanilla, if you are not into vanilla, you will not like the scent. Rose, if you are not into florals, if you're not into those, if, if you're not into like rose smells or like gardenia smells or anything like that, you're not gonna like the rose one. If you're not into fruity, or if you're not into like that fruity, flirty type of vibe, then you're not gonna like that. But if you are, you're gonna love it. And really, that's all I have to say about it. I love them. I just feel like there's a time and place for everything. There's really nothing that she's made that I've hated. Um, and that's why I really love her stuff, because I can work with it. Even if it's not something that I'm crazy about, I can either layer it, or I can use it after a shower, or there's just a time and place for any of it, really. So anyway, that's the review on these three things. These are three things that have launched since my last video, in my Diamonds 2 collection video. I just purchased the new, which she came out today, she came out with today, the three candles, like the winter candles. And I'll be doing a review video on those when they get here. But for now, this is what you get, babies. So as always with my fragrance review videos, there is Yes, another giveaway. I love giveaways and you guys have been so supportive and have shown me so much love that it just makes me want to do giveaways all the freaking time. And originally when I said I was going to do this video or we planned for this video, I said I was going to do one giveaway um, or, one, or give away one item. But because I love you guys so much and you showed me so much support in the last video, I'm going to give away two Trio Purse Sprays to two lucky winners. And you guys know the deal, you know how to enter, but I'm gonna repeat it just in case. You need to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and when you're done, just comment done. So when this channel hits 1500 subscribers, I'm gonna go ahead and pick two winners to win the Trio Purse Sprays. As always, thank you guys so much for your support. It means so much to me. So while I was shooting the outro to this video, my dog, Olaf, decided he wanted to be in the shot. So, Olaf, now's your chance. Now's your time to shine. Um, we just both, collectively, want to thank you all so much for your love and support. And if you want to keep up with me on a daily basis, you can follow me at NicoleonXO. And that is all, guys. Love you so much. And thank you so much.